The real key to the eco uh, credentials of this property is actually the simplest. It's completely airtight. It's the most misunderstood point of, of keeping a property low energy. We've actually built the roof and the walls in a completely different way. We have a totally airtight membrane that comes all the way down the roof, all the way down the walls, on both sides from the inside and the outside, so no air can penetrate at all. The, the humidity is dealt with, but we have no humidity inside the property with a special air system. All the joinery that we have has also been specially made. It's very simple. We just put a, a face seal all the way around the door that you can see, which means that there's absolutely no drafts. And the result is a, is a property that has no loss of heat through, through air change. We've got 20 large solar panels. They produce heat all the year round at different times. Every little drip of heat we get, we stick it in the ground and it's stored in the ground and we take it out whenever we need it. And what's amazing is you can actually store it in the ground in the summer and use it in the winter. That's how the whole property is heated. All the heat comes from these panels. The panels are just connected with, with liquid to a, a, a kilometre of tubing that is laid onto the bedrock. We've, we've removed the soil and laid the, 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 the tubing on the bedrock and it just heats up the bedrock. It's really a sort of a self-contained sewer system you like anywhere else where the, the, where the water is, is, is taken through many, many different stages. The net result is drinking water, not that we, we drink it, but um, is then put out of the ground. But it, it completely removes all toxins and all nasty things and, and takes, us, takes us back to drinking water. Because you're airtight, you would, you would end up with a, you know, a stale air situation if you, if you weren't changing the air. But we actually change the air in the property once every two hours by taking the air and dumping it outside and bringing fresh air in. But the outgoing air heats up the incoming air so you don't lose the heat of the property. So you actually end up with a situation with, with um, very fresh air all the time. But the other main advantage is you end up with very, very low humidity, which has huge, huge health benefits. Um, amongst other things, but it also makes a very pleasant environment to live in. We achieve 25% humidity inside the property, which is getting onto desert type humidities, which is gorgeous. The rain that runs off the roof comes down the, 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 the normal down pipes instead of just disappearing into the ground or wherever you put it. We put it into a tank and then that comes in back in, is pumped back into the house to feed washing machines, loos, etc massively reduces the, the water consumption of the property. Again, anyone can do it. It's low cost, simple. You could build a property like this, scaled down, at exactly the same price that you build any other property for. You could improve the quality of how, it, how you live in it, it for the occupants. You could do it for the same cost and you could do it now. We don't need any new technology. In fact, the Scandinavians have been really using air tightness in this way for the last 30 years. <laughs>